Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how to fix this issue with your machine where your PC will not load and needs repairing and it shows uh, this blue screen of death, the 0 times C000 ending in E. Uh, typically when you'll see this error you won't be able to boot to your Windows 10 desktop uh, but don't worry it's an easy fix. So the first thing we need to do is create a Windows 10 recovery media um, so this blog post that I've written, I've actually detailed how you create that. So if you just um, come to here, create a Windows 10 recovery media. Uh, so basically what you need to do is you need to, I've got the direct links here. So you need to download the tool, uh, double click on the tool. It's just a .exe file uh, and then you just follow these prompts. So you need to create a media, uh, select the options. So what version of Windows you've got. Um, you can create either a, a bootable USB flash drive or you can actually um, create an ISO file. Uh, that ISO file, once it's created, you can just right click on it and do burn to DVD and you can use a bootable DVD. Um, so yeah, we're going to use a flash drive. I find it easier. So you just need to select your flash drive there and then click next. And then basically it's going to download uh, all the files it needs. The files are roughly 2.5 gig in size. Uh, so depending on your internet link, it could take uh, some time. Uh, but once that has downloaded, uh, remove the USB drive from that machine or DVD, uh, put it into the machine you're having issues with. Uh, then if you reboot and boot to that media, you might need to go into the BIOS and um, reorder the boot device priority uh, putting the USB or the DVD uh, device higher or higher than the hard drive and once you boot to it the first screen you're going to get is this so select your original language and make sure you select your keyboard input as well and then click next uh, on the next screen do not click on install now click on repair your computer And on this screen, if you click on troubleshoot and then click on start up repair, uh, once you click on that, an application is going to launch that will check your Windows 10 operating system for any issues uh, that could be causing an uh, issue with the startup. Uh, if it does find any issues, it will automatically fix it. Uh, once the scan is finished, um, remove the USB drive or DVD from your system and restart. Hopefully you'll be able to get to your Windows 10 desktop. If not, come back into here, go to command prompt and type in this command, chkdsk space c colon forward slash r forward slash f. If you run that command, it, it will take typically between one minute and 20 minutes, depending on how big your hard drive is and how many files you've got on there that's going to find any file corruption that exists on your C drive, on your operating system drive, and it will automatically fix it. Um, so just run that command when that's finished, type in exit in this uh, black window, then come in here, turn off your machine, uh, remove your recovery disk and boot up again. I hope it will go to the desktop. If not, come back in here, click on troubleshoot, click on uninstall updates, and then uninstall both of these updates. This is going to basically uninstall the latest uh, installed Windows updates in your system. Uh, it's possible that one of these updates has caused these blue screen of deaths as well. Okay, I hope you find this guide useful. If you do use it, uh, please let me know in a comment how you got on below. Uh, if it doesn't work for you, uh, let me know what you've done and I can help you out trying to fix this problem. Uh, but thanks for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.